I know when we started dating, I know the last thing you probably expected was that the first challenge we would be together as husband and wife was stage four breast cancer. <laughs> that was probably not what you were expecting, but what I admire about you is that from day one, since we found out, his attitude hasn't been, you know, a lot of people would say, this is not what I signed up for. But what I admire about Mark is that his attitude has been, this is exactly what I signed up for. And it's because of him that I wake up every single day and I know that we're gonna beat this together. And I just can't wait for forever with you. And I love you. And I love you guys, thank you. Loved ones, we are gathered together here in the presence of God and these witnesses to join Holly and Mark in holy matrimony. In the years they have been together, their love and understanding of each other has matured and only now have they decided to live their lives together as husband and wife. And so I ask you, sir, who presents this woman to be married to this man? Her mother and I do. Perfect. When a girl is as accomplished and intelligent and beautiful as Holly is, sometimes people overlook her generosity of spirit. And she's shown me that over and over again as time has gone on. So I, I absolutely adore Holly. Uh, I know some of you are just getting to know Mark over these last few years, but this guy's really an absolute amazing friend. When nobody's looking, he does it right. He humbly considers others better than himself all the time. Um, one of the most selfless guys I've ever met in my life. And uh, I'm, I'm blessed to call you a friend. Because that's the kind of friend that Holly is. She's, she's a good friend. She's an easy friend. She's so easy to be friends with because she's just so genuine and she's so kind and just all, everybody in this room knows that. I, I, I get that. So there's, there's no adjectives that I can use in here that you, y'all don't already know about Holly. <laughs> and it's like I, I feel that the first half of my life and I didn't even realize it there was someone that was holding me up over the railing so I could see even in all the things I do today professionally and personally I know that he's truly there like hoisting me up over the rail and and, and letting me see and and I'm, I'm forever grateful. One of the most moving things that you guys shared with me was when you were diagnosed. And the first thing Mark did was grab you when you walked out and said, that's not our story. I feel like, honestly, in that moment, this happened. And now it's just a celebration of it. From what we can tell and what we've always thought, that the Stars woman is, is courageous and has gumption and is smart. And I feel like Holly truly embodies that. I saw that Mark was just his head over heels for Holly as she was for him. And watching this relationship grow into love and now marriage is really the greatest gift that Holly could have possibly given me as her friend. I got to tell you, if, if there was ever a match made in heaven, it would be you too. Hi, it's a first look with everybody. <laughs> love. Love is an unbelievably important ingredient to a successful marriage. You guys have that. <laughs> We're getting married. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm Mark. Choose you, Holly, to be my wife. Hi, Holly. Choose you, Mark, to be my husband. I promise to learn from you, to believe in you, and to care for you. 
promise to be your family, to be your friend, and to love you, always. I promise to keep myself open to you, encourage your dreams, and help shoulder our challenges. I promise to be your partner and equal in all things. In all things. I promise to be faithful and supportive and to make our love my priority. I promise to care for you, stand beside you, and share with you all of life's adversities and all of its joys. I take you, Holly. I take you, Mark, as you are and who you are yet to become. I promise from this day forward to be grateful for our love and our life. I encourage you to grow as an individual and inspire you to do so, to love you completely. These things I pledge before you, our friends and our family. These things I pledge before you, our friends and our family. <laughs> I made it. <laughs> the fact that uh, we planned this wedding and threw it together in eight days is nothing short of a miracle. Especially, I don't know if y'all know me, I might be a tad high strung. Uh, but I feel like Mark's rubbing off on me in a good way though because I wrote this while I was getting my makeup done and normally it would be in a spreadsheet, like color coded and iambic pentameter, but as you see, not. Holly Mark. When I look at you two, besides being possible cover models for some high-end social magazine, I see two people who complement each other. Together, you are better. Better than when you were apart. I hope to find what you have one day. It's such a loss for words looking at you know all these people in this room. You know, when I first met Holly, uh, I was probably Pretty, pretty selfish in my ways, and uh, you know that the old saying is, you know, there's a, there's there's only two things in life that are guaranteed, and that's death and taxes. But through a mutual friend and some uh, good advice, I really kind of learned that in life, no one rides for free, and you can't do it alone. And uh, in dating Holly, I saw that you know she would be the one that I could do it with you know I, could, I wouldn't be alone and I, th I feel strongly she feels the same way you two have some incredible things in store for you guys in the future as a couple and I and, and we everybody here tonight are just so excited to be able to be by your side every step of the way in this incredible new adventure that you guys have in your lives. So, so here's to Mark and Holly. May the two of you, may the two of you have many, many years of love, happiness, and health. To Mark and Holly, love y'all. To the happy couple. For so much as Mark and Holly have consented together in holy wedlock, I pronounce that they are husband and wife together Father and the Son and of the Holy Spirit, those who God hath joined together, let no one put asunder. Amen. Mark, you may kiss your bride.